hello everyone in this video i will share about how to create a search control list acl in custom component of joomla 5 so oh, first of all the access control list mean uh, we have created this button in previous videos if we go on click on this and here in permissions uh, we can add uh, which user can do what uh, text to give access uh, what admin can do what user can do like that uh, we can give the actions action control and there uh, we have to show the list here so in this video I will share about how to create that action uh, that access control list So to create the access control list, let's go to our code file. Uh, we are working on administrator components and here com hello. In this com hello, to create the access control list, uh, we have to create in the access file first access.xml so create new file under the com hello our component folder and let's give it as access.xml here we have to create the xml file xml version equal one point and encoding equal utf8 that we are creating assess so assess tag and the component will be our com hello component and there in the section name equal com hello in this section we have to add actions so the first action its name will be core.admin and let's give its title as j action admin now this text will come from joomla language files uh, we don't need to create by itself for this titles in this access file so and the next one is description equal uh, for the description we have to create but for the title we don't need to create action admin component tsc let's give like this and close it after that copy this and let's create for the next one core dot manage and here also g action manage and the next one is core dot create action create and the next one is for delete core dot delete and the action here also delete and the next one is for for edit edit and 
the next one is for added state added dot state and in this also added state okay and the next one is added Oh. Now uh, we have created seven action. To show in the control list, access control list. Now we have successfully created access.xml. And the next step is let's go to our config.xml file. And there, let's add this actions also. So copy this actions and add in this field. this and the next step is to create the helper function so close this and go to helper file to create function in helper file so yeah that is at sub menu for the sidebar and let's create for the access control list and first protect static actions after that create the static function because we have to call from view file so uh, we give it some static function and the function name will be get actions and here let's check self actions is empty or not user well, factory get user and the next one is self actions equal a new object CMS object after that for the actions assess get actions and our component name come hello after that we have to create we have to loop the actions so let's loop with for each loop action as dollar sign action and it will be self actions and set is as action name and the user authorize action name comma com hello now we have created the get actions function and and we have to return this we have to return this actions 
return this return self action now we have created our get functions in help our function and the next step is we have to create in the uh, view file in our view.html.php yeah we have to add we have to call that access list and at here in this at toolbar function let's call that helper function that we created as get action so hello helper uh, because we can then call this like because we have created that helper path that require once in our hello.php file so hello helper get actions and there in the actions if can do can do is core dot create and there toolbar helper will be at new hello dot at this mean if the action is core dot create we add that hello hel uh, toolbar helper as hello dot at let's copy this and the next one is edit so hello dot edit let's create for delete delete hello dot delete sorry for the at we use the at new for the edit we have to use edit list and for the delete method we have to use delete list and there will be a pop back box for confirmation so are you sure at like that and comma to dot delete now we have called that helper functions in our view file let's save this file and and this alpha file also save this and let's try to run let's go to our Joomla 5 site let's run refresh this and if we go to options and in this permissions now you can see the access control list close this now we have successfully created our access control list in our custom component in Joomla 5 so Thank you very much for your attention.